sliced baked potatoes. So far, there are no baked potatoes. Mm-hmm. Not even once baked. What are you doing now? Well, I had a little potato trouble. Potato trouble? Yeah, I spilled my potato water. Potato problems? Yeah. So, these are potatoes from Idaho. Idaho. Yes. They look russety to me. Mm. I was going to get Yukon Gold, but I didn't see any. Any kind of potatoes will do though, right? Says you. Any big potatoes? I just like just... that shape. Okay. This is twice baked potato shape. Now how important is having squash in the oven for... Craig, it's New Year's Eve. Of course there's squash in the oven. Yeah, but like, will it affect the, uh, will it affect the recipe if they don't put squash in the oven? Yeah. Well, that's like a no-brainer. Yeah, but like, what'll happen? The potatoes could actually explode when you take them out of the oven and decapitate you. Wow, they explode and then decapitate you if you don't have, so what is, how does the squash prevent that? It's science. Just science? <laughs> yeah, or it might be math. It's probably a little both, honestly. Maybe I have some English in there too. Okay, so the first thing you do is just wash the potatoes, don't even chop them up, just put them on a pan. Mom is almost going to just put them in the oven with no pan, and I was like, Mom, that's going to be really hard for me to take out later on. For him. <laughs> I won't be here. I'll be at church. <laughs> yeah, I'll be taking care I of it. I poked them with a fork. Po oh, okay. You poke them ahead of time? They're pre-poked. Pre-poked potatoes. Well, I didn't buy them pre-poked. Try to say that too fast. I didn't pre-poked. I had to poke them myself. They're pre-poked for you because you don't have to poke them. You prepared the potatoes with pre-poked yeah. potatoes? They're, they're prepared pre-poked potatoes. Okay. Okay. So, they're in there. I'm thinking about an hour-ish. On... Um, uh, well, let's see. It says 325, so it's probably closer to 400. Mm, I know. I don't know. Something about me let's, lying. Let's, let's open up the. Let's open up and look at the thermometer. Okay. Uh, it looks like it says 325 there, Mom. <laughs> it's still, it's still heating up. Oh, isn't that convenient? Okay, you know what? I'll put it on 400. All right, fine. And check it. Yeah. Check it. I'm yeah. never gonna know. You know what? Maybe I will. Fine. Yeah. Fine. So poke them. Be sure you use the same poke holes that I've already poked in them, because otherwise you could have the exploding decapitation mm -hmm. thing again. And also poke the squash, okay. and when it's done, take it out. Wow. Then when I come home, I can scoop out the taters and uh, get on with my life. Mm -hmm. That's all I got. Okay, so they're in there at like 400 for an hour? 400 for an hour, yeah, so about 530-ish. Okay. Yeah. Happy New Year. Knife. Knife, yeah, spoon. You almost said fork, didn't you? No, I almost said spoon, knife. Ooh. Very confused, Bill. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut these taters in half. The long way. Yep, the long way. And scoop out the middle, leaving enough tater tater behind to give it some structure. Mm-hmm. You're pretty much making this recipe up as you go, aren't you? I am. I looked at a couple cookbooks. <laughs> I looked at, there's one in the start solution that asks for tofu taco topping. So you made tofu tacos yesterday, so hey, mm -hmm. we've got that. I'll have to make that recipe video soon, too. And then a little bit from uh, Rip Esselstyn's My Beef with Meat. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of taking the seasonings, which I will use the same seasonings anyways, basically onion, garlic, and pepper. Yeah. Nutritional yeast. And a little cayenne pepper. Mm hmm. Um, and then I I looked at this, I guess I'm not really using it from this other book. I picked it up for like five bucks somewhere, I haven't done much of it yet, but The Vegan Cookbook. Wow, The but Vegan they Cookbook. They had The Vegan Cookbook, but they had one Did you get with, that at the store? I got it at the Ollie's. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty much like the store where you can get like... Good stuff I, I don't too. even know if it's like generic stuff, it's like... It, well, it's stuff it's, that's been discontinued or yeah. they changed the packaging or whatever. Like if you were gonna... If you were furnishing an apartment for the first time, mm. you could get you could get yeah. all your stuff there. Yeah, pretty cheap. Yep, good stuff, cheap. That's what Ali's is known for. I don't know if it's all over the nation or. Yeah, last time I went, I actually asked a guy, and he said that they have a lot of stores that actually open up more. So. East Coast, nationwide. Uh, I don't know. I actually forgot. You didn't grill so them. There's did a you? couple in a couple different states, though. Okay. Like potato boats. Yeah. Like zucchini boats with potatoes. And these cooled off for a little while, so they're. I mean, you can see the steam coming up, but they're 
they're cool enough for me to handle without uh, burning my mitts. Yeah, or your hands. Yeah, that too. Or your paws. Yes, let's pause for a moment of silence. Okay. Long enough. This is a vegan steak knife. Hmm? It's a vegan steak knife. Mmm. It's a tofu knife. Yeah. Yeah, I saw on the Vegan Zombies channel, he said, you know, just because you go vegan doesn't mean you have to get rid of your steak knives. That's you can good. still use them for opening up tofu packages. That's good to know. That's what he said. I use it for cutting up fruit, bananas in particular, Yeah. on my uh, feeding trough of oatmeal that I eat in the morning. Mm-hmm. Two more tates. How many total is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, I think. When we're all done, we'll just divide by two and then we'll know. As okay. long as nobody snuck any. I was trying to count each one as like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. I was off by one. Now we know. <laughs> ah, don't cut your hand. I'm trying very hard not to. <laughs> you remember you, when uh, Leah was little, you put ketchup on your hand and you told her that you were bleeding and she started crying? Yeah, I thought she'd get the joke, but I guess she, <laughs> she wasn't under my sense of humor yet. <laughs> Well, what are you gonna do? I don't know. I could probably still pull that one off on her. When she walks in the door, I'm bleeding! She say, well, you led a good life, Mom. Yep, it's been nice knowing you, mostly. It hasn't been the worst. Yeah. My favorite mom so far. Not so far. Okay, I think I'm gonna mix my spices in a little dish and then then put them in that way, just that way they can get all mixed up. I think I'm going right. to do about a teaspoon of each. Are you going to eyeball it? Ish. Yeah. Ish. Kind of. No, I'll measure it. All right. Uh, you're going to measure it? Yeah, I'm going to measure it and then I'll throw in some nutritional yeast. So I'm doing garlic powder. And I, when I say teaspoon, I think it's kind of a heaper. Mm-hmm. Is a teaspoon though, not a tablespoon? Yeah, that's a teaspoon. Oh, okay. Teaspoon of onion. I'm not using any salt because I'm not about that life. Mm. Okay. Dad's not about that salt life either, are you, Dad? Boy, is a questionable stool came out great. Really? Yeah. Maybe we should put some on a potato. Should take the top off so it's cool. I just did it because it was in my way. Oh. We can put it in the sink. Well, no, don't do that. We can't can put it back on when you want to put it away. Why not? It'd be clean when you put it away. As soon as I'm done you here, I'll take it You're going to clean it all? Uh, I could. <laughs> I could get one of my sisters to do I it, too. I could. <laughs> Play your cards right, Dad. <laughs> that was ground uh, mustard. Ground <laughs> mustard? Oh, I missed some stuff, huh? Yeah, it's okay. I think you already took a picture of the... Yeah, uh, distracted me. This is nutritional yeast. <laughs> I'm it's important yeah. that you have your nutritional yeast. Yeah, okay. heaping, like more than like normal. Oh, it's probably about or three tablespoons. Than, okay. You want to keep it in a candy cane canister? Mm-hmm. Very important. Mm-hmm. Stir that stuff up. Hey, what are you doing with that squash, punk kid? You're not going to eat it, are you? Look, there's a plane. Oh, where? He's lying. It was a bird. Oh, look, there's a deer. I don't see any of these things that. Oh, he did, did you, eat it. Can you stick that somewhere, please? I'm just. I just need a little bit of space. The sink. That'd be good. Or on the counter, whatevs. Okay, so I'm gonna plug in my mixing machine. This is a vintage mixer. I believe I paid two dollars for it at the thrifty shopper. Wow, I've never even seen it before. When did you get it? I believe it was 9.9 .9 months ago. A big spender, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Steep price there, money bags. Keeping stuff out of the landfill. So you're putting like mashed potatoes in the potatoes? Yeah, that's why they call them twice baked. I think okay. it's because they bake them twice, not because they take potatoes out and put potatoes in. No, they're gonna be baked twice. Even the metal's gonna be baked twice. This is a special mixture that stays on even when you turn it off. Oh. It's a feature. <laughs> 
There we go, I unplugged it. <laughs> I'm gonna throw in some uh, veggie broth. Smooth things out a little bit. Yeah, I'm eyeballing it. Mm -hmm. That's what I do. <gasps> it, it's broken. Uh, wow, you gotta plug it in just to get it to work? Yeah, weird. What the heck is this? Good thing we got the electricity in our house now. Yeah. Just got it. Electricity. Okay. Nope. Come on. No. Okay. It's not gonna stay off. <laughs> we like things kind of flavorful here, so. Nutritional yeasty. Yeah. Steve, do you suppose you could hand me a spatula, please? Don't you have a better mixer? Yeah, it's downstairs in the basement for making truffles. Oh. We have a. Oh, gee whiz. Oh. It's Craig's filming, so we have to pretend that we don't take things off the floor and use them, so. <laughs> yeah. Got it. Thank you. The one we have downstairs is state of the art. It even has a headlight. Oh, That's really? for making truffles because your popsicle needed something that was. Now, how often do you have to change the headlight fluid on that thing? I think just yearly. Oh, okay. Just like when you change the batteries in your smoke alarm, change mm -hmm. the headlight fluid in the mixer. Mm. You just have to set like the same thing so you just know. Yeah. Like daylight savings time is the recommended uh, yeah. battery change in time. They were good to smash. That smells good. It smells yeah. Garlicky and nutritional yeasty. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to add some daya cheese too, so it's going to be cheesy stuff. Oh, that squash, Dad. Awful. You're just going to save Awfully it. Awfully good. You're going <laughs> to, I was going to say, you're going to eat it so we don't have to. Wants to look a beater. There's not much to look here, never mind. Yeah. Pulse alarm. Spoke too soon. Oh well. If there's any extra, we can use it to frost some brownies. Mm hmm. Okay, I think I'm gonna also, well, I think I'll taste this. Alright. It's a good reason to taste test. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's good. Mad good? Mm hmm. Throw some corn in there. Okay. There it says. There it says. Mad good. Wow. Mm hmm. Throw in some corn and might as well, I'll throw some daya cheese in. And then I'm also going to sprinkle some on top. Here's my vegetable broth knob. Mm, oh, it's right here. Get some of this stuff out of the way. Awesome sauce. <laughs> that looks like a quarter cup to me. Looks like a little bit less. Oh, well, if you say so. I do. That's good. Okay. I'm gonna cram some in these potato shells. Top I thought you them. said they were potato boats, Mom. Now they're potato shells all of a sudden. Sorry. Which is it, there. Mom? I, 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 I don't know, Craig. I'm really sorry. Yeah. Don't make yeah, me cry. You should be. I told people that you can cry on command. I don't know if people believe me or not. I don't have it in me right now because I'm like in thinking mode. I have to think about something <laughs> sad like, um, <clears throat> what's something sad? I don't know. I don't think of sad things. Apparently I don't either. Well, maybe someday in the future you can do a tutorial video on how to cry, how to make yourself cry. I just make crying, <laughs> like that. I mean, is that is that vegan though? Because it causes animal suffering. I mean, if we're animals, you know. Is what vegan? 
making yourself cry because that's that's causing another mm. another well, sentient really being suffering. to suffer. I'm pretending to suffer. Yeah, but you said you think about sad things. That's that doesn't sound. Can't fun. think of anything sad right now. Yeah. Okay, sad things like uh, somebody ate the last cookie dough truffle. Ugh. Stuff like that. Mom, you're gonna make me actually cry. I know. Or I'm out of organic whole wheat flour. Wow. Stuff like that. Or I've been having a hard time getting a hold of the uh, don't be piggy meatless sausage-ish crumbles at Wegmans. Mm-hmm. I'm having a very hard time getting a hold of those. That makes me sort of sad. So see, I have issues. Yeah. I have the struggle. It's real. Here we'll get a thumbnail or something. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> it's your thumbnail. <laughs> I, I thought that's what you wanted. Oh. If all these potatoes go, don't go on the shelf, somebody's going to have to eat them. Oh, geez, a little. I know. I bet Dad's going to be awful disappointed if he has to do that. Yeah, if you want to get any, it looks like you're going to have to get there before he does. Yeah. He seems to be a little hungry tonight. Mm-hmm. He's normally not. He's in celebration mode. Yeah. Celebrating not going to be working until Tuesday. Wow. Because apparently it's bowl games and that's a holiday. Dad, are you, are you really bummed that you don't get to work for the next couple days? Yeah, it's awful. Ugh, if only the big bad boss would let you work. <laughs> <laughs> that was his evil laugh if you didn't know. Okay, so those tapes are up for grabs. Now I'm just going to nestle that here. Mm -hmm. and let's have some of Craig's tofu topping. I saw that. You didn't see anything, Mom. That stuff's mad good. It is. Later this week, maybe me and Dylan will make a recipe video. You haven't done that yet with a... No. I, I actually made the tofu taco stuff in like 10 minutes. Tops. Well, to be fair, the, the taco mix, the taco seasoning was all ready for you. That, yeah, that's that true. That helps. Yeah, we'll have to make that too. You can show them the back of the label. That's where I wrote all my ingredients. Yeah. Or I guess you could call it a recipe. Mm-hmm. I just like to make up a whole bunch at a time. So, then you, so to, you can make yeah. tofu top, taco topping in 10 minutes. Yeah, and a lot of the time was just the cooking time. It wasn't so much like the getting it ready. Okay, I'll throw some cheese on these bad boys and it's almost time to get this party started. Wow. Oh, I can, do you think I should make egg rolls too? Hey, I am not going to stop you. Well, it's not so much make egg rolls as get the egg rolls out of the freezer, put them on a pan, cook them. So hey, you, either way, I'm not you're stopping down for you. It. Okay, because just a couple days ago I made about 50 pounds of food. That's all gone, so yeah. I guess we don't have any trouble getting rid of this stuff. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm gonna pick up this cheese shred off the floor. Wait, I gotta get some more thumbnails. I don't know which one I'm gonna pick. So artsy. There we go. Uh, I'll probably use one of those. I'm going to keep the pepper out because I'm going to do things to the squash. Okay. And then you just put it in the oven. Mm-hmm. And then just hope for the best. Put it in the oven, hope for the best. You put it in the oven, then you get the egg rolls out of the freezer. Oh, okay. Yeah. What uh, what temperature do you set the twice baked potatoes at? 325, which should equal 400 degrees. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. We found out the hard way that mom was telling the truth. <laughs> anyway, it actually is off by like 75 degrees because mom said it to four, was it? You said it to 400 and it was, you checked it and it was at 500. Uh -huh. So that was 100 so, degrees. I mean, it could be off depending on which temperature. Yeah, it might be off by like using. percentage wise. So it might yeah. be like, you know, the higher you set it at, the more it's off. I don't know. I just cook food. Either way, mom was right. And that's mm -hmm. what's important, right? Yep. I just cook food till it's done. Mm hmm. Hello, Kara. Where'd you guys go? Hello. You hungry? Yes. That's good. Okay, so this says 450. So 
If I do three seventy-five. Right in the middle. Yep. Wow. It's kind of worn off there a little bit because I think somebody mentioned how old our oven is. I think a lot of people did. Someone just said like, thirty years Hey, old. when you make enough YouTube money, why don't you buy your parents a new oven? I could buy a new oven. And Don't yeah. want to. <laughs> Don't yeah, want like to. we just I use it until it's broke. Well, the the newer ovens, they're all digital, electronic, and digital things break yeah. faster than plain old heating element stuff. So I will use yeah. this until it can't be fixed. They don't anymore. make them like they used to. No. Don't worry about me. I could buy a new oven. Don't particularly care to. <laughs> He's with Leah Bow. At the movie bow. Oh, oh, they went to see the Star Wars thing. No, the Fantastical Beasts and Where to Find oh, Them bow. I was close. You were close, Bo. Very close. Okay, well, since there's going to be a bunch of us, I'll make a bunch of egg rolls. One bunch. One bunch, one metric Strawberry bunch. Now everybody knows where all our secret pans are. Yeah. These are, this is a cookie sheet, Craig. Oh, cookie that's what a cookie sheet, sheet is? I guess Some only things. people who are subscribed to both channels will get that. <laughs> Some things you can't live down. <laughs> Never. I think I was the one who brought that up in that video. You did. Because <laughs> we, we were trying to think of uh, ego busting or ego bashing stories of me. And we couldn't think of any because um, Brad said was it, you can't, can't make fun of perfect or something like that. Did he say that? Or did he say that? that? No, he said it. I think he was talking about me, wasn't he? No, he was definitely talking about me. That's enough for your ego. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> you guys have anything to bash my ego? Any stories that'll bash my ego now? Can't think of anything, Craig. I'll get back to you on <laughs> okay. that. Okay. Uh, Can't bash perfection. What did you get, Kara? Okay. Kindle cover. Wow. Don't worry, it's vegan. Vegan. It's, it's really vegan. Yeah. yeah. Does it say vegan on there, or is it on, just on, on Amazon? It said it was. Oh. Wow. Oh, vegan. do you ordered it? Vegan leather. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even know it's like fake leather. I thought it was just like made out of plants. Plastic. It wasn't pretending to be leather. It's a Kindle cover. Yeah. Gotta pet it. All right. We done. We done. We done. I'm gonna cook it until it's brown. I don't know how long it's gonna be yet. This is my first time. I just made this up. Yeah. In front we, of y'all. So. We will. We'll see when it comes out. We're, we're gonna cook it for as long as we're cooking the egg rolls, which at this point is 12 minutes, and now it's at 4:50 because that's what the egg rolls are gonna be at. So. All right. We're gonna cook it till it's brown. Ish. I like brown things. Brown and crusty. Mm. Yeah, that's what I like. I'm all about that brown and crusty life. Look at that timing. Look at that. That looks good enough to eat. Mm -hmm. I have some egg rolls to release from this oven too. Those look good enough to eat too. Yep, fresh out of a box. So are these from Traders or are they from? BJ's. BJ's. Wow. Yep. Oh. And they're vegan. Ling Ling was the brand, if Ling -ling. anybody should care, Ling Ling. All right. Yep. So here, here's our tapes. All right. So what? What did? Uh, so it ended up being what About degree? Okay. So 20 minutes total after they're baked. Yeah. So bake them for like an hour. Cut them in half. Scoop them out. Yep. Make that mashed up stuff. Yep. Season it. Yeah. And then about 20 minutes. In the oven with some day of cheese on there. Yeah. Wow. Or you could use some sort of a, a meat fake. Crumble type of thing. Oh, yeah, that would be like instead of like the tofu stuff that we did. Yeah, but you could like, use a sausage crumble or, uh -huh. or soy chorizo or yeah. whatever. Or you could just do potatoes if you if you really yeah, like you could potatoes. Do potatoes and cheese and yeah. Um, corn. Yeah. yeah. You don't have to add all that funny stuff. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, that's uh, that's dinner for New Year's Eve. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Dad's also got uh, his. I, I tried this. It's really good. It's one of one of Dad's best soups he's made in a while, or stew. Dad said it's stew. Vegetable chili stew-ish. Dad. I think he might have... Oh, he, I mean, it's out of focus anyway. There he is. That's the best stew we've had in a long time. Mmm, good. 
He's a man of many words. <laughs>